Good morning, Riley. Good morning. I know, Bubba. Just two more hours. You guys, Riley's not feeling well. He's limping. A little bit better today? You're okay. You're still so happy. What's wrong with your leg? Do you need to get it wrapped? Something happened to your paw? Go drink water, baby. Go drink water. Let's go drink water. Hey, it's better today, baby. I think last night was the worst. We just woke up, it's eight o'clock in the morning. Last night, something happened to Riley. We don't know what it, what it is. We don't know if it could be his elbows, it could be in his actual leg, it could be his paw, we cannot figure it out. So I just called the vet this morning and we were able to get in to the vet in the next few hours, which I'm honestly so grateful for because it's so hard to get a vet appointment where we live. Just cause there's not a lot of locations around, you have to travel a little further, but it's his front right leg. I don't know what it is I'm just praying that it's something small and he doesn't have to go through so much pain but you guys last night he was crying this morning he was crying trying to get up so it's just been a roller coaster ride for us you guys look he's limping Bubba and the thing with him is he won't lay in bed every time I get up he follows me here Bubba why don't you get on the couch and just lay Georgie Why don't you get on the couch, baby? He still can get on the couch. He can still get up. Oh, and he's eating fine, and he's playing with his toys for a little bit. He just is in some type of pain. Riley, up! See? He's so pretty good. Good boy. No, <laughs> he's still love brother. Why don't you sit and just hang out and relax, okay? You gotta relax your paw. Oh, baby. I hate seeing our dogs, like, sick or anything. Hello! We are home from the vet. Georgie's right here. Turns out, it's the same issue that I thought it was. Basically, Old English Sheepdogs are very prone to arthritis in their joints, so it's mostly like their elbow part. And so around that area, it has a lot of soft tissue, and sometimes that can get irritated when they get up from the floor. And then as you guys know, Riley loves laying on the floor. He's obsessed with it because it's nice and cold. So when he gets up, he puts too much pressure on his elbows, and I think he went a little bit too hard playing yesterday as well. So they gave him medication for the next week. He also has to lay pretty low. So if you guys don't know about these, these are pill pockets. If you guys are dog parents, then you guys know. Pill pockets are basically these, and you get the pill, and you put it in the pocket, and it basically disguises the pill. I wish I had this when I was little. When I was little and I didn't want to take my pills, my mom would like mush it up so it looked like a coke, like it looked like cocaine in a spoon. And then she would put water on it and then I would have to take the spoonful. Now that I think about it, I think that's more disgusting than swallowing a pill. But yeah, that's what she used to do for me. I'm gonna give Riley this. He needs to take this every 12 hours to help with his pain and his limping. He has gotten a little bit better, so I am really, really happy to see that he's improving a little bit better on his own. I was really worried that he fractured something Thing. It's just always hard to see your dogs in so much pain. Also, another thing is if you guys do not have health care for your pets, please, please, please do so. Depending on your pet's breed, size, and age, you could be paying like $25 a month for Cooper and Casper since they're young and small. We pay $35 a month. Old Man's a senior dog, so we pay $115 a month. And then Riley is 100 pounds and he's a bigger breed, and so we pay $65 a month for him. But it covers them 70% to 80% should there be an accident. So pretty much today was fully covered, which is really nice. We have healthy paws for our pet insurance. A lot of people always ask, I'll link it down below for you guys. Not sponsored at all. We learned about Healthy Paws when we were rescuing our dogs. Sit, baby. Good boy. And then, if you guys have one dog that takes a pill pocket, these are not really used as treats, but your dogs, your other dogs can have some as well. They are too expensive to be snacked. <laughs> but if one dog is sick, the rest of them allegedly get sick too. And Georgie gets an extra because he is, hey, Ro hey, it's Riley's, no stealing. Ay, ay, ay. Four boys, you guys. Also wanted to show you guys something super exciting in the Ramos household. We got a water filter system under our sink. I will link this one below for you guys. I just got it installed yesterday by the amazing Mario, who literally does everything around our house. Hello, hello, we got a water filter system. We're about to taste some bougie, clean, fresh water. I'm so, so grateful to have clean water, you guys. Just in general, honestly, this is such a luxurious 
thing to have. Like I never thought I would have a water filter system. I got this off Amazon. I will link the exact one down below. I went with the 100 one because that filters out more water and it's supposed to be cleaner. It did take a little bit to install. Mario was trying to like figure everything out. But with that being said, I also got a new faucet here that I'll show you. But that thing is so big. Don't mind the mess. I had to move all the cleaning products out because the water system was taking up everything. Got a new faucet. Ain't she beautiful? I also got her on Amazon. I will link this faucet down below. You guys, look at the new water system. <gasps> oh my god, water, water. Okay, don't waste water. I'm so, so grateful. Mario, if you guys have a handyman, if you don't and you live in the area, make sure you guys call Mario. He had to punch a hole. He literally cut a hole into our countertop to install this for us. Yeah, I'll link the water system filter and this faucet down below. Another thing, I don't know if you guys noticed, if you follow me on Instagram, then you already know. I got my bottom teeth done. Dr. Shu went ahead and did composite bonding for my bottom teeth as well because he did such a good job with my upper. I will list Dr. Shu's information down below. I got a comment in a previous video that said, are, is he sponsoring you? Like, why are you talking about him so much? And I'm like, no, not sponsored at all. Dr. Shu, if you would like to sponsor me, oh my God, please feel free to. But no, I paid out of pocket, found him on Yelp. Everything is completely out of my bank account. He did not pay me or tell me to say any of this. His work is just amazing. Yeah. Oh my God. Remember I had some gaps in my bottom teeth? They're all closed now. I have never felt so confident. So honestly, like not trying to be cringe, but I just feel beautiful. I feel confident. I feel good in my skin now. It's just crazy. Cause like we all have those little things about us. Like I've mentioned before. And like I got comments that were like, oh my God, but I love your gap. Like it just makes you who you are. And I totally agree. But there was something about it. It was just one of those things where it just did not make me feel good about myself. And ever since I got my teeth done, I have felt so confident and I feel like I'm glowing and I just, I feel really good in my body. Highly recommend Dr. Shu. If you're in the area or you're willing to drive to him, he is amazing. My task today is to tidy up and clean the house because guess whose family's coming in 48 hours and they're gonna judge every single corner of this house, my family. So my mom's coming, my sister's coming, and my nieces and nephews are coming. My brother is not coming only because we are leaving all four dogs home and usually when Kim Sung and my nephew come and now they have a baby come, I wanna be super safe and make sure that the dogs have their own space and then the kids have their own space because kids are kids and my nieces and nephews are amazing honestly and they're so good and like their parents are great too Riley just totally farted but just for safety reasons they're still very young and very small and so I'm gradually teaching them how to be around dogs because my family doesn't have dogs like I grew up with like zero knowledge of how to be around dogs I was scared of them for the longest time and it's so crazy now I'm a dog mom and I have four dogs of my own I'm gradually teaching my nieces and nephews obviously right Riley has to stay home this weekend, so a lot of her plans really change. That is the reason I do want to have a day where my whole entire family comes. It is just really hard because my brother just had a baby, so things are a little bit difficult. But Kim Sung is actually sleeping over next weekend, and I'm really excited because she's six now, so she has a better understanding of dogs. So now Carlos and I are teaching her how to be around Riley. She's fine with the three littles. Like, the three littles are fine because they're smaller than her, but Riley really scares her. Like, Riley's 100 pounds, and he's ginormous. So he really 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 scares her and I, I think it's funny because people always say like oh my gosh Riley looks so much smaller on camera and I was like in person. They're like whoa. He's huge That's the situation. So I want to tidy up the house because it looks like a mess Remind me tonight at 11 30 p.m. To give Riley his pill. Okay. I'll remind you at 11 p.m.
friends, income has been so good for us lately that it was just time that we like hire on a private chef. And she's here today. So I want to introduce you all the way from Korea, Michelle Choi. 안녕하세요. 안녕하세요. Can you tell us, chef, today what we're eating? 오늘은 밥하고 C 물고기입니다. Different way. <laughs> 감사합니다. Mm -hmm. I might forgot a syllable. Thanks, mom. You're welcome. Michelle cooked today. I think we should just do this from now on. Michelle comes over and she cooks. Why not, right? Yeah. Oh, the cucumbers, mom. <laughs> oh, yeah. We're trying cod today for the first time. I think. No, it might be our second time. So we don't really know the difference between, thanks, mom, our fish. Asians eat a lot of fish. Yeah, we and I don't. I don't know I their names. Don't know any. So right now, Michelle, I know tilapia. Tilapia. I know mahi mahi. Okay, and like then swai and salmon. We know salmon. And salmon. So we're trying cod because somebody in the comments was like, Kim, you should try cod. So I got cod today, and I also bought more tilapia because you guys know I love tilapia. And then made some jasmine rice, and then couldn't get water spinach. You guys know I've been on a water spinach kick. So we're doing cucumbers. Ooh, uh, look at Chef Choi's fish. It looks beautiful. The rice looks nice and dry. I love it. Also, <laughs> Diet Dr. Pemper. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Thank you. I also ordered papaya salad. I found this place in Orange County. I will link it down below. I linked it in my previous vlog, but oh my gosh, they make the best papaya salad ever. And this one I got with raw blue crab. Can you guys see it? Best papaya salad ever. Are you trying the cod first? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. This is the cod. Yeah. Ooh, she looks coddy. Like fishy? You know how some fish are more yeah. fishy? Is this the fish we use for hot pot? Are there bones? Why is the, I don't think so, I checked. Okay. Bon appetit. Bon appetitis. The seasoning's very good. I don't, I don't think I like the cod. Y'all lying. I don't think I like cod either. <laughs> Y'all out here lying to people. The seasoning, mom, you did amazing. Thank you, it's everything that's in your pantry. But the, the cod fish is chewy. Do you think oh in hot pot? God, I know what cod is. What's cod? Alma eats a dried up cod. Like she dries up her cod or she uses cod to do like the egg little batter thing. Mm. Yeah, no cod. Oh man, I bought a whole bag. Mom, you only have two more pieces. Oh, okay. Who wants them? I'll ship them to you. <laughs> We are tilapia girls. And salmon. She's over salmon. I'm, I'm a little over it. salmon. Michelle's not. I still love salmon. Mm. So part of the contract was that I eat with the chef. Because mm. <laughs> I have this thing where I think she'll poison me, so. But what if I poisoned that one and then brought over my plate? You would never. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, mom, the tilapia. Gosh, this is so freaking good. The tilapia slaps. Slaps. Did you buy it yet? No. I'm coming up with my meal plan grocery list right now. Mm. I'm so glad you told me Target has it though. Mm. Cause I don't know where I would have gone to get tilapia. Any grocery store? Mm. I don't know about that one. I don't know either. I think it's the so biggest funny. cucumber ever. I think it's funny that like, I don't know how seafood works in like an American grocery store works. Uh huh. Cause we're so used to buying things that like watching our moms get them at the Asian market. Oh yeah, like when my mom wants fish, she goes to the back of an Asian market and they mm -hmm. make it for her. Papaya salad. Mmm. See rice. You really like the sticky rice. Mmm. Oh my gosh, so good. Mm -hmm. This is delicious. But your marks are exactly at. One three sixteen. That is a weird place to put a center. <laughs> yeah. Are you sure? <laughs> Wait, really? <laughs> Mara, do you need a stack or st stool? No, no. no. <laughs> Cause I'm short too. I have a bunch of those. You guys have to hold it from right here. Okay. Do I hold it from there too? Come here. Oh, okay. I'll go in. Half. Yeah. <laughs> Just have to grab it from the outside. Okay. Uh, just make sure it doesn't go all the way back. Okay. Okay, I'm good. I'm good too. Oh my god, it's secure already. <laughs> <laughs> they can't there you go. No way. No, I tell Rika every day, I'm like, I just share half of your husband. <laughs> We are trying a brand new fire noodle ramen, har, har, banaro lime. It's habanero. 
Ha! <laughs> Where's the extra R? That I found new at the Asian market. It's brand new. Looks like this, everyone. Take your screenshots. <laughs> We're gonna try it for the first time together. Together. Cheers, mom. Cheers. Mom, why is it been the whole package? I get the whole feel for it. Wow. Mm -hmm. Mom. It tastes good though. Oh, I hate it when it tastes good, but it's so spicy. You know, mom? Take another bite. Mm -mm. Oh my god! Take it home. Take it home, mom. Spicy. Mom, you can take that home. Cause that is me. My pussy's sweating. Oh, I think my ass crack is sweating. Oh my god. Come here, food. Wow. Mm -mm. It is good though. Oh, that hurts my tongue. Mama. Oh my god. What's wrong with you? She put the whole pack. I said only a little bit. But the full effect, you know? Mm -hmm. I'm blocking you on Instagram. I feel better. I feel better. One more bite. Ma'am? Huh? No. That's is that more spice? Is that spicier? Mm-hmm. Give it to Maiden. Ask Maiden to try it. It's really Ooh. good though. You okay? <gasps> That's spicy. It's really good though. It is. It tastes really good. Why'd you put the whole pack? What's up, bitch? <laughs> He's gaming. So Kim decided to start playing <laughs> Diablo 4. <laughs> oh, this is Diablo? Yeah, this is Diablo. Oh. How do you know I was playing Diablo? Yeah. Correct. How are you liking it? I like this. It's easily manageable. Damn. Oh! Ah! <laughs> no! Sorry, boys. You need help? I think this is a little bit easier for Kim because you don't have to move you don't have to move the camera around. Oh, my friends are really helping. Oh yeah. Do I kill that thing? That animal? No, it's a deer. Oh, okay. You, you don't have to, you okay, can. I need to go in here. Nice. Nice. I'm getting places, babe. We'll see how far she makes it. <laughs> Hi, baby. Hello. How are you? What are you gonna do today? So you're gonna help me pick some weeds. Give mommy kisses. Give mommy kisses. Oh, baby, your eye looks better out here. Oh. Yeah, he came over because the, the game was open, so he was like, he wanted to know what we were doing. Oh. All right, Papa. Uh, Mommy will be back soon. Love you. He's, he said he wanted to say bye. Did he escape? Yeah, but he's good though. He was just there, and I told him to go inside. Oh, the gate was open. I accidentally left it. Papa. Come here. He's good though. He's a Give good boy. Give mommy kisses. Cooper, on the other hand, would have just been in Orange County right now. He would have ran to Orange County and been like, Grandma. All right, baby, you're safe. Bye. I just left the Asian Mini Mart, which is the little Asian mini market that I go to in our small town. And they always have water spinach. And he always gets it restocked on Saturdays, but not a lot of people buy them because they don't really know what it is. But he always has a crap ton of water spinach. And I go in today, and there's only a little bit left. So I was talking to him, and he was like, yeah, I don't know what happened. Today, like, there was like a bunch of people that came in and bought a bunch of water spinach. It went by so fast. So I was just wondering if any subscribers that live in my town or around my town, you guys went and got some because I was like, that is suspicious. Every single time I go, it's fully stocked. No one ever buys them. And now it's going quite fast. So just curious if anybody went to the Asian Mini Mart recently or today or yesterday and got some. I was able to get my hands on the last few because I wanted to eat it today. And tomorrow my mom's coming. So I need to do a huge grocery run because we're gonna have a feast in the backyard. But first, I gotta go get my nails done because this one's breaking and I think I'm going to do OPI again I bought these colors I think a few weeks ago at star star stark star oh my god it's this like nail shop in Orange County I will link it down below for you guys if you ever want to buy your own gel color but I think I want to do Lisbon once more by OPI it's this really nice like pinky shade so I think I'm gonna paint my nails that today and give French a little bit of a break so excited for my mom to come tomorrow But first we need to do all of these errands tonight and clean up the dining area. I chopped my nails They're so cute though. Oh, I forgot the color. It's D and D 876 I believe but I don't remember the name just the number But yeah, my nails were my nail set was pretty old and Joyce was like you need a new set But we both didn't have time today. So I'll have to come back for a new set So I was like, oh, let's just chop them off go short and do a spring color 
here since it's officially spring now. But isn't it so pretty, you guys? I love this color. Oh my gosh. Joyce also told me that she will be on vacation for like three weeks. So I think the next time I see her will be the last time before she goes on vacation. They're so cute. I'm gonna try to find this color. I think it's DND876, but I love the color. This is actually my real nail right here. I was driving to the salon and it literally broke. I don't know if I showed you guys earlier. She was like, well, since you're getting a new set next week, we'll just paint over this nail so you can have presentable nails for the next week when we have more time. I'm actually really into this short nail so I can actually type and answer emails way faster now. But they're so cute. Look at them. I'm at my Target and it's pretty empty. I feel like everyone's decorating for spring. I just saw this in the Magnolia section and I think it'd be perfect to roll spring rolls. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. It's $10. I think they have a darker wood too. They have spring dresses out. How beautiful is this dress? I love these. You can just put them on spring, summer. So easy to dress up or just be casual. They're so cute. There's also black. Good morning. It is Sunday. My mom should be here in the next hour and a half. I am prepping all of the shrimp right now. Look how much shrimp we have going on. We are grilling outside. I'm so grateful, you guys. As you guys probably heard on the news, California has been raining for the last three months. It is the most rain we have ever gotten. And for the first time, oh my gosh, the weather is so, so nice. It is close to 70 degrees outside. The sun is out. The clouds look animated and so fake. They are beautiful today. It's so bright and beautiful. It's glowing. I'm so excited to sit outside. But first I'm going to set up the patio area because you guys know we got new table, tables and chairs. I'm actually going to transform the outdoor patio area I think in the next two weeks for a video. I think that would be really really fun. Maybe kind of spark a little bit of decorating into your life for spring and I also want to do a lot of spring cleaning. I don't think we could have asked for a better day to have me madre over. Oh my god. Gosh, my whole family's gonna like love it outside. If you guys missed the previous vlogs, got this table off of Facebook Marketplace for $250. It's originally like a thousand dollars, and I got such a good deal. $250. You guys cannot beat that. It's the most beautiful oak color. It was scratched up a little bit. Mario, our handyman and also very good friend, fixed it up a little bit for us really quickly just so we could use it today with my family. But oh my gosh, I love it. And my favorite part about it is that it actually expands. Look at this. Oh my goodness. It looks, oh, I'm going to expand the other side too. Oh boys. Look at them. Riley, come here. Let mommy show you something. Look at this table. Riley, look. It expands. Riley, look. Oh my god, you almost hit your head. You guys, it's huge. It expands to 118 inches to give you a good idea. That's honestly so cool. And if we don't want these out, we just had it before where we just put it under and then move it. I'll link the actual table down below. Maybe someone in your area is also selling it for cheap. This is my dream patio table. Like, it's so cool. And these are the chairs that I also mentioned before. But in case you missed it, I got it at Target. And I actually got it for 50% off. There are originally two chairs for $250. And I got two chairs for, I think, like $170 or something. But I think they still have the 50% off sale. So I'll link it down below for you guys. They're so, so cute. Very easy to put together as well, but this is what they look like and they come with cushions So this is the bottom one and then you tie it with the strings on the back and then there's also like a back cushion So people's backs won't hurt when they lean but I'm so excited because our previous chairs were so uncomfortable They were from Ikea and they didn't come with cushions and also the butt part was incredibly small So these are so cute if you guys are looking for kind of that wood vibe for your outdoor area I highly recommend they also have another one on the Target website that looks extremely similar to this but way more expensive and I can't quite tell you guys why I'm trying to figure it out myself but make sure you buy one that's 50% off I'll put the exact link for you guys this is what the chairs look like oh my goodness you guys this is so beautiful it looks so grand oh my goodness now we have a place to eat I love it it's so beautiful look at this oh my goodness I'm obsessed 
How beautiful is this? Oh my god. Okay, so I just took the tails off all of the shrimp a few days ago. Remember, I got it at Costco. Not Costco. Oh my god, Stater Brothers, you guys. And I'm so glad I bought it because I went to Stater Brothers last night to see if they had some more. And they didn't have it. So I'm glad that I bought all of that. And now I'm going to peel the other tiger shrimp. Like this one, I have to actually peel everything. I just finished plating everything. It's giving me the bejeebies. <laughs> I don't even know if that's a word, but it's making me feel some type of way, okay? I don't know, this is how they display it, this is how my mom does it, but I don't know how I feel about all of this. Okay, moving on. Carlos is covering the table with white dining cloth just so we don't ruin the top of the beautiful table. But you guys, look how beautiful it is. Oh my goodness. I think this table is gonna be gorgeous for like dinner parties, huge dinners, Thanksgiving would be so cute on this table. The white looks amazing. I am making my famous, in my family only, <laughs> famous green sauce for spring rolls that I always make whenever I eat spring rolls at home. So really excited to roll today. It's funny because we always just say like, oh, let's roll, but that has like a meaning, a different meaning <laughs> for a lot of people. We're not rolling that. We're rolling spring rolls today. So in here I have a bunch of garlic, I have a chili pepper, and then I also have chopped up cilantro. Just because this chopper sometimes gets all tangled up whenever I put like the super long pieces of cilantro in, hopefully it won't get tangled up today. I'll go ahead and link this chopper down below for you guys. I've had this for years now, probably like what, we're going on three years together. I bought this when I first moved into this house and I can't get rid of it, even though sometimes it doesn't work, to be honest, because I put too much stuff, but it's amazing. It just chops everything in seconds. Oh, I think we're good today. And it's like a little arm workout. Yes, that's exactly what I'm looking for. In the end, you're gonna get everything chopped up. It should smell like heaven. It smells so good. If you are a cilantro, garlic, a little bit of spice fan, you are going to absolutely love this sauce. And then adding on to that, we're gonna do some sugar and we're gonna do fish sauce. So if you're Vietnamese, we kind of have a little bit of a war going on about which fish sauce is the best. This is my favorite, the Three Crab. This brand is my favorite. Every time I use other fish sauce, I just don't like it. This one is so, so good. I'm gonna go in with three of these spoons of sugar. And I honestly just eyeball everything. We'll do four, we're doing four spoons. And then we're gonna do the same amount, four of the fish sauce. And then we'll do like a half. And then you wanna mix all of that together. I think the rule of thumb, if you're eyeballing this, is just even parts. So if you're gonna do one spoon of sugar, you wanna do one spoon of fish sauce, you wanna really balance out the flavors. And to really amp up the spice, I would do Thai chili peppers. That is literally going to give you amazing butthole burn in a few days, because that one's really, really hot. And then we're gonna get a lemon or lime, but today I have lemon in stock in my fridge. And what I love to do, honestly, is I wish I had some red chilies because a lot of this is green, and so adding red chilies would just really bring out the color. And I think the lime is honestly going to really pull it together. We don't need this much. I would cut this in half. I mean, sorry, the lemon. So you wanna squeeze the lemon in. And then to add color, I'll go in with some either sriracha or chili garlic. Like I said, I would do some red chili peppers, but I don't have any. So we'll do like one teaspoon of that. And then you wanna mix all of this up. Like the red just adds a little bit of color. I learned that from my mom. She's like, color is everything. If you present something <laughs> colorful, people are gonna be more interested in trying it and eating it. It just looks more appetizing. And then you wanna add, so you can eat it like this, but you see how it's kinda thick? Like some people love this, like cause they can scoop everything in one bite. But if you wanna dilute this a little bit, obviously, and share with your friends and family, you would add very warm water, as much as you want, just to dilute this sauce. So I am going to add a little bit of warm water to this. But first we shall taste. Mm, just to see what else we need. And just a little bit of, and then probably a little bit of sugar, like this much of sugar. But we also don't want it to be too sweet. 
Perfect. Mommy grapes. They look good. And then we have some shrimp and we have some egg rolls and more shrimp. It looks so good, it smells so good. We're just gonna wait for this and then we're gonna start setting up outside and then we're gonna start eating. We had to switch. Oh my got me this tray for mukbangs, but it doesn't fit in the oven. I've already cooked this, I'm just warming it up. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's already cooked. We got shrimp, we got shrimp, we got shrimp, shrimp, and more shrimp over there. We like shrimp in this like, family. Yeah, we, we got, got some dogs noodles. trying to steal food, which is not allowed. Oh no no! We got some noodles. We got two grills going on. Mommy, yeah. the Yeah, there's a lot of food. Hi, how do you open this? Hello. Tell mom it's a secret. She's gonna come here and scream. I already feel it. I already know my sister's still gonna be like, oh my. Babe, will you get the lighter? Yeah. They're so cute. Here, I'll help you. Can you make sure no dogs are in the way? Close the I was helping. No, 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 you're scaring me. There we go. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Okay, happy birthday. Yeah. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Oh <laughs> <laughs> Almost burnt down right now. <laughs> Can you find the card? Yeah. Never buying these again. Here, Ryan, you have to cut your cake. It's tradition. I just don't want you to eat that. Mommy, I'm going to Did you get your favorite? The raspberry. I don't, it's not my favorite. I think it's the best one they got. No, I like the plain one. Baby, <laughs> there's only three people playing. Because <laughs> no one has money. Do you have any money? I don't have cash. I don't have cash either. Do they take Zell? I have quarters. I don't. Oh. Yeah, you can play with anything. That's money. Oh, the quarters are in the drawer. I don't have any money. You should play. I'll play the other one. Can we do that? Can we get like a stack of fake money? <laughs> no, you gotta play with real or it's bad luck. Oh, oh shoot. Oh, shoot. Sleeves are going up. Yeah. Oh. Ask Mama if she wants me to play. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mama. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Chồng của con muốn chơi không có tiền. Ai là cá? He's gonna look for money for you. Tell, tell her that there's tell her there's quarters in the drawer. Yeah, And she has to put a mango in her mouth real quick. Wow. Wow. Oh. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> so I got I got that and fish. I got crab and fish. Come on, crab and fish. No and no. Oh. Oh. Wow. <laughs> we lost. Yeah. <laughs> Two on trip or one? Two. <laughs> Okay, don't listen to me anymore. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> don't listen to me. <laughs> oh, five? Mm. No, no, no. One, one. Oh, five. oh, it's only by one? No, mom's saying that's not a good move. Oh, he got it. Die! Yeah. Oh, don't listen to mom. <laughs> <laughs> Babe, hurry up! Hurry up! Okay, 
Hey, this little table is coming in handy. Oh, they can Mom is so dramatic. What's seven plus eight? Sixteen. Seven plus eight. My mom is so. Fifteen. Mom got zero. That's Mom why. Mom got zero. <laughs> Someone's coughing. We are trying to be safe. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold on. Here, I got dragged into this. Hey, but this is beneficial too. I don't get sick, Mom. It doesn't matter. I'm literally it only taking matter. it. Moral support. Mom, this pin did not be perfect. No, I just licked the little bit that came Wait, out. Wait, what are okay. you doing? I'm taking so, it raw. This thing right here is supposed Wait, to. Wait, we're all taking it raw. Raw dog or nothing. Ooh, this thing right here is supposed to cure absolutely everything when you're feeling ill. So I really hope because I'm kind of feeling ill, yeah. But it tastes like. Wait, what? Mom, you didn't prep us or anything? No, like I said if I'm being forced to do this, I'm prepping mine, uh, my own. But you it didn't even help me out, sister. But Your husband like, didn't either. Ugh. This tastes like butt. Basically, what it tastes like is, is Vaseline. Vaseline. Yeah. The texture is Vaseline. It smells like Vaseline. It tastes like Vaseline. No, no, no. We're doing it like this, and then you have. You're to not mixing, mom. No. You guys, we're raw dog. Can, can I open it? <laughs> You better not pour it Can in. Can I open it? Yeah, you're gonna You open better it. not Why pour it Why are you guys in. bullying me? I'm not. Oh my god, I hate you guys. You better not open it. Oh my, I have my chaser here, which is chips. Don't smell it, mom. It gets worse lick, if lick you- Lick that, lick. No, lick, no, lick, no, lick, no. Lick. I'm taking it, no, lick, no, lick, no. I did, no. I did, it's lick. only fair. No, she won't lick. No, I, I'm taking it, ready? No, Why? no, 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 oh, mom, okay. come here. What? Come here and do with me, ready? Ready? This is our lemonade, and then Michelle and I chasing it with chips. Chips and the lemonade. Okay, ready? Chips and the lemonade. Yeah. Ready? One, two, two three. three. Oh my gosh, it's so bad. But I guess the worst tasting kind of thing. Didn't even taste it. Wow, that was good. Uh -huh. I did it so fast, I, I don't think so I did it. I literally didn't even let it touch my tongue. I just swallowed it. I squeezed it all the way to the back and swallowed. That's how she takes shots. That's why she's so good at it. Wow, we're healthy. That wasn't that bad. <laughs> We're if you do take the time to taste it, it's it's a bad idea. If you guys do want to like try this for your health, just blend it with something. It's so much easier. Oh god. But there are people that legit just like don't chase them nothing. Highly recommend. This is bomb. That was so good. Hopefully it works. Hey, this lemonade's really good. Well, people say it works, right? Uh -huh. Like it's really good. Salud.